Guys, let's look at the heavy rain fogs here in Moscow. Hello. <laughs> yes, I don't know which side I should take, but I think I should go this side. <laughs> and I hope my GoPro is not going to to have water or to get wet. Where are you watching this video from? Today we are just walking in the center of Moscow to see how it is raining. I've got a bucket with myself. There is a bag inside. It is quite uh, a vlog that I've been wanting to do. Oh hello, welcome to Moscow. There are heavy downpours here. There was uh, a concert, now we just finished. It was cut short because of the rains that are taking the glass of the People are just moving with umbrellas. You know, I've been wanting to walk in the rains, especially here in Moscow. It has been long since I did such kind of a thing. Oh, we can even hear the thunder in the background, thundering. Oh. The, the worst thing that could ever happen is being uh, struck by lightning. <laughs> oh. People now, they have begun to make movements. I was at the center here, in Moscow. Look! All the way up to there. People are just running away from the rails. People have officially started moving. If you are new on this channel, don't forget to subscribe. If you are a returning viewer, thank you very much for always coming back to my channel. Leave a comment. Are you experiencing such kind of rainfall or, da or heavy downpours in your country? Like the way we are experiencing it here in Moscow. I don't even know where I'm going, but I'm just showing you life here in Moscow in Russia what is happening at the moment the concert has been cut short I think it is going to start raining again it's just a matter of time If there's something that I appreciate or I love to experience, it is the smell and the sound of the rains. Here it doesn't smell. It maybe it's because there are so many buildings around, but when I was in Zambia, you could even smell that no, it is about to start raining. All the verandas shut down indefinitely. That's how nature is. You can't play with nature. Nature has got its own way of putting us back into our space or place. If you are scared of water, that's why you can even see other people they have got simple umbrellas covering them it's good that i've got a gopro which is waterproof i can film whenever it is raining where there is water it's fine
It is very hard to understand the weather here. You find that it is summer, it is raining, it is always like this.
is what is happening here in Moscow. I don't know if it is going to rain again. Feels like it is. and you thank you welcome This water is smelling chlorine. Seems like people are scared of showers, huh? They are waiting for the showers to finish and I don't know if the showers are going to finish right now. This is what is happening here in Moscow. Sometimes I just feel like in this place we always uh, have a different view according to the seasons. When you come in summer it's different, when you come in winter it's different, in spring, autumn, just like that. This is yet the same place and it keeps on transforming according to the 
season well this is what is happening right now here in moscow we are experiencing some heavy downpours heavy rains across moscow it is something that is taking place from time to time <coughs> the smell of these uh, trees something that i cannot fathom yeah, i don't know it could be these ones they are the ones uh, producing the smell that i can't uh, understand and people are always uh, curious to know where the smell is coming from I love the smell of rains, as I said in the introduction, but here you can't feel the smell. Look at the flowers just recently planted. Beautiful. In the parks, I always say that here they consider mental health to be one of the most important things people they have got parts where they just go relax refresh their mind all the way from Africa the Kremlin. Yeah, I said that there is something smelling and people are smelling the flowers to understand. <laughs> people sometimes they even go to Kremlin Museum. Well, it is a little bit uh, expensive. For a small YouTuber like me to buy the ticket and get inside. When I become a big YouTuber, oh, such kind of things not going to be a problem. But at the moment, walk with me. Just understanding, checking what is happening here in Moscow. The rainy day. I wanted to make a vlog where it is just raining. Unfortunately, here in Russia, you find that it only rains for 10 minutes, 15 minutes. That's maximum. But in Africa, you find that it is it can rain for many hours continuously. Here, it is a different story altogether. I have had some people asking me how can you buy the ticket if you want to go to the Kremlin Museum. This is the place where you buy the tickets. Right here, you check the time, they'll give you the ticket and you go explore this place. Moscow Kremlin Museums that is it that's a place where you can buy the ticket that is a video for another day now the sun is slowly coming out What is uh, fascinating for me is, uh, you know, despite this place being the place where the president of Russia works for, you can get inside as an ordinary uh, person. I mean, when you buy a ticket, Kremlin there, you check other things about this place. Unlike like in my country, even just walking like this near the state house and fuming, it is another hundred ways of you wanting to go to prison or to be incarcerated because it is not even a, 
allowed to film the whole fence there. But here, they have just made things simple because it's a public place. How I wish our people can understand this and, you know, change a lot of things for us. Because I remember just, you know, someone standing for the longest time, they'll ask you, what are you doing there? But here, it is quite simple. Simplicity at its highest level. I'm filming at the place where the president works from outside the offense. You can even see the offense. You can see a lot of people sitting around. But in other African countries, of which I'm speaking about my country, it's a different story altogether. Such things, if you do that, it means eh, you just want to to go to to the sales for a few days. I don't know if they call it trespassing or whatever, which irritates me at times.
кирпичный. 